A new film from EWTN Ireland was recently shown at the Vatican. Faith of Our Fathers tells the story of a Catholic priest in hiding during the 16th and 17th centuries. Faith of Our Fathers depicts the priest's time in hiding and the surrounding community's efforts to protect him as he ministers to children and celebrates outdoor masses. This amid a crackdown on the Catholic faith throughout Ireland. Joining us now from Rome is Aidan Gallagher, director of EWTN Ireland. Great to be with you today, Aidan. Uh, can you tell us more about this film? Yes, Tracy. It's a pleasure to be back speaking with you again. Yeah, the film Faith of Our Fathers, it's set in the penal times in Ireland, roughly between the 16 to 1800s, and follows the struggles of a Catholic priest to minister to the Catholic faithful there. Uh, and it follows the story how he was teaching the Catholic faith in the hedgerows because Catholic education was banned, uh, Catholic doctrine was banned because it was forbidden, in fact, outlawed to pray to celebrate the Mass. Uh, the Irish language was also outlawed. And in addition to that, the Catholics were barred from public office. So we decided to create this particular piece because it has so many contemporary correlations and relationships to the modern day. And this uh, screening that we did in Rome, it was just amazing to see the feedback. And it was almost like a proof of concept, if you like, uh, because so many people stepped forward to say, yeah, this movie may be set in the penal times many hundred years ago in Ireland, but we, are still experiencing this in our country today. Yeah, and I also, another thing I want to talk about, Aiden, is I understand um, that you presented this film at the Pontifical University of the Holy Cross in Rome. And, and so let's talk about that. You know, what was the feedback from the international audience there? So what they were able to draw from it by the, by the feedback that we received, and I'm talking feedback received from uh, Pakistan, from India, uh, from United Arab Emirates, from countries that came forward, they say that th they are experiencing very similar uh, things like that in the country where they were speaking from. But they were inspired because it showed that even though uh, evil tries to root out the manifestation of Christ, you know, in his church, uh, through the Holy Sacrament of the Mass and the Catholic Church, that as the Lord said, Peter, you are the rock, and on this rock I will build my church, and the gates of the underworld cannot hold out against it. And that's what happened in Ireland, and that's why I suppose there were so many people came to us, particularly from those countries, and uh, voiced you know, those very positive sentiments. That is wonderful. Aidan, we're almost out of time, but quickly, I'm curious, how was your meeting with Pope Francis? Um, I understand you asked for his blessing on this film. Yes, it was a very blessed occasion for me personally and indeed for the whole mission of EWT in Ireland. It was wonderful because as we step out and again put our heads above the parapet to try and preach the realism and the practical uh, nature of the gospel, not only in our own country but throughout the world through EWTN, that to seek our Holy Father's blessing on that was just, again, astonishing for us, you know, because the Holy Spirit is what we need to propagate this message of truth, propagate this message of commitment to the Catholic faith, particularly in these modern times. So that was a very, very a strong thing for us, and thanks be to God for it. Absolutely, Aidan, thank you so much for taking the time to speak with us, and, and God bless you on this film. Uh, can't wait to see it. Thank you again.